Kicking the Financial Ass um, by Paul Christopher Dumont, MBA, CFA. Um, punch debt in the face, invest for the future, and retire early. So, great title. <laughs> Um, so there is a legal disclaimer, um, so I'm only going to read a little bit of it. Um, the views expressed by Mr. Dumont in financial, kicking financial ass is solely his and not intended as investment advice nor a guarantee of any financial return. Um, he's not an investment or tax professional, um, so don't substitute it for um, professional advice and um, a few other mentions. So um, part one is foundations. So um, be more with less, know where your money is going, and then chapters three to seven. Um, part two, growth, chapters eight and nine. Part three, investing, chapters 10 to 12. And 14, living your life, chapters 13 and 14. Um, so, um, you get a quite a bit of topics throughout these different sections. Um, the happiness equation, change your expectations. So, um, like, what do you like? Are expecting to kick to get back or to um, do um, take action to feel um, in control so like whether it's budgeting meal planning going to the bank and like saying hey this is too high of an interest um, I want it lowered combining stuff whatever um, Find out your net worth, budget, budgeting techniques, saving tips. Um, there's a summary at, at the end of each chapter. So like the basic points or topics to get out of it. Um, well, like talked about. Um, power versus saving, power of saving versus spending, emergency fund, retirement building, um, side hustles, salaries, stock investing. Um, it is a US focused writing um, or like um, investments or like portfolios. Um, there is a few mentions of um, like um, like similar um, things or, or what they would be called in Canada. So there is that little bit of um, for Canadian readers. Oh, I can do these things. So you get that. Um, though the author is living in Canada, so um, so it's it is a comparison between the two countries. Um, so yeah, um, uh. Yeah, so it is a newer financial, like personal financial book. So if you're wanting something and like once released in 2005 or 2012 may not be as relevant. Yeah, they may have the same things, but like the stats and stuff may have changed a little. So this is just giving and like side hustles are more um, common for a lot of people so having that and um having a comparison between us and canada because like some people are dealing with um finances in either country depending on where you are but yeah kicking financial ass happy readings